we will say that two events are independent if knowledge that one of these events has occurred does not affect the probability of the other one occurring. And we can indicate this uh, in symbols in the following way. So if we have the conditional probability E given F and that is equal to the probability of E in other words same probability but without the conditioning event then by definition these events are independent. And of course we will say that events are dependent if they are not independent. Okay, so for example, we have an experiment which consists of rolling two dice, and one of them is red, the other is green. We're going to let F be the event that a 5 shows on the red die. We're going to let G be the event that the total on the two dice is greater than 10. And we want to determine whether these two events are independent. Okay, so we know if the two events are independent, then the conditional probability must be the same as the unconditioned probability. In particular, uh, the probability of F given G must be the same as the probability of F. So what is the probability of F given G? Well, uh, according to the definition of conditional probability, we need to find the probability of the intersection of these events and then divide by the probability of the conditioning event. And now when we roll dice, the outcomes are equally likely. So all we need to do is count the uh, these two sets. So let's see. The intersection of F and G. F says that the 5 shows on the red die. And G says that the total must be greater than 10. Well, there's only one way we can get a total greater than 10 with 5 on the red die. Namely, if we have a 5 on the red die and a 6, on the green die. That's it. On the other hand, for G, G is the uh, set of outcomes where the total is greater than 10. So that would be 5, 6, red, red 5, green 6, or it could be the other way, red 6, green 5, or they could both be 6. All of these totals are greater than 10. Okay, so we have the number in F intersect G is 1, just one outcome there. On the other hand, the number in G is 3, and therefore this conditional probability is 1 out of 3. Okay. On the other hand, what is the unconditioned probability? Probability of F, probability of getting a uh, 5 on the red die without reference to anything else happening is clearly 1 sixth okay, because there's six sides to a die. Okay, so we see that the answers we get for uh, these two probabilities, the conditional probability and the unconditioned probability, are not the same. So therefore, the events are dependent.